Hello, 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 everyone. Welcome or welcome back. Thank you very much to Tilly Does It. Today, I am back to budgeting. I'm going to try to start <laughs> making these videos because I have just been so busy, so tired, and I need to get back to basics here. I do a lot of happy mail, and that's how I show my support to my girls. I love their envelopes, their budget binders, the stickers, all of that. And you will see another happy mail coming up very soon. But today, we are going back to budgeting. So, I have literally a whole month's worth of fixing up to do. And you're going to come along with me for that ride. Okay. So be prepared. It's going to be a long journey. Get some water. Go to the bathroom first. Do what you got to do because it's time to start. Okay, guys. Here is my box of money. Or money box. <laughs> and I just keep all my money in here. And it's just been accumulating, as you can see, for oh, quite a while. Okay. I'm just going to take it off, close this, and you can get this on Amazon if you like it. I do have a link below. So we just have, we have to go through all this money. Look at that guys, yikes. But we're going to do it. We're going to get this done. I hope everybody had a wonderful 4th of July and had a nice barbecue or you went out on vacation hope everybody had some fun okay so we're gonna go ahead and catch up with our sinking funds and also this is gonna be like a sinking funds update as well because it's the end of the this is for the end of the month and this is everything okay so these are my beginning balances here we're not going to go through them because that's a lot. We're just going to go ahead and start adding what we need to. So first, we have my challenge binder. And yes, I did buy a whole bunch of different binders and a whole bunch of different envelopes. But that is for something coming up real soon. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start with Carter. And Carter gets the Dollar Day challenges. And for the past five weeks, five paychecks basically, I have to add $140. All right, so I'm just going to take a $100 bill and 40 like that. I'm going to go ahead and count it because it's been a while. <laughs> Okay, so we should have 1056 So $300 is in the bank from a previous time, which I explained before. So it's going to be 300 400 500 600 700 800 900 950 970 990 1010 45, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. I'm contemplating on whether I should just take out that $300 that I have left in there and just put it back in here because, you know, I used that money for his birthday. Um, the rest of that money for his birthday. So there was $1,000 in there and I used $700 for his birthday. Yes, I know. Okay. So we have... $1,056 for Carter. Okay, so we're going to update for the next five lines. So after yellow is pink. Okay, so pink, green, yellow, and then pink here. Okay. Now we have green, so pink, green, yellow. So then we're gonna come up here and we're gonna highlight this week up here because we have $756 
for a dollar a day. And then last, we're gonna come back down here and highlight the yellow. So we just finished a whole column. Wow. Ooh. Okay. So 756 plus the 300 is 1056. Back to this, we have Christmas next. And Christmas, we need to add $100. So we're just gonna add a nice $100 bill to that. So Christmas should be $568. One, two, three, four, five. 20, 40, 60, 1, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68. And yes, I'm one of those people that, oh, this is going to irk me. A little stuff there. Okay. All right. So that's fixed for those people who are just like me. That's it. Just, oh, okay. So that's nice and fixed. So that is $568. All together now, Christmas, yay, holidays and gifts, we're going to skip for now, medical, we're going to skip for now, we're going to go ahead to auto, and auto's going to get $475, wow, okay, so we're going to take the last one, two, three hundred, and we're going to do... 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. And then we're going to take the 50, 75. Okay, let's move this back a little bit because we don't need that empty space. All right, let's go ahead and count. First, we're going to count where I'm going to add. So 100, 200, 300, 350, 70, 90, 410. 430, 450, 470, 475. Then we go ahead and add it to this. We're going to go ahead and add it up. And we should have 2060. So we have 1000, 100, 200, 300, 800, Eight thirty, eight fifty, eight seventy, eight ninety, nine ten, nine thirty, nine fifty, nine seventy, nine ninety, two thousand and ten, two thousand thirty, two thousand fifty, two thousand fifty five, two thousand sixty. Okay, so what I could do is change out my hundred. Um, placeholders, but I'm going to leave that for another video because I want it to be longer. I don't want this to be longer than it already has to be. That's $260. Let's go ahead and highlight my paper. So here we are with my 5k challenge. This is Foxy's 5k challenge, and I miss you so much, Foxy. You have no idea. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and highlight the next five because we're at $2,060. Okay, so we're gonna start with the pink. So after yellow is pink. So it goes pink, green, yellow, and then pink here. That is done. We're gonna go with the green. <clears throat> so pink, green. And we're gonna come up here and highlight this. And lastly, <clears throat> the yellow. And we are all set. And right now we are at $2,060. So this and this is all updated. Good to go. Now I do have some extra money here as you can see. Uh, I do want to give some money to holidays and gifts i did have a game scheduled for these but i'm going to start it in july and just for june i'm just going to go ahead and just add 20 dollars for each for each envelope 
so no $25 I'm sorry $25 for each envelope $5 a week we should have 229 for holidays we're gonna add the $25 to it So let's go ahead and count 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 229 dollars. And for gifts, it should be the same thing. So we can go ahead and add a 25. Just gonna go ahead and count real quick. 100, 50, 70, 90, 200, 10, 20, 5, 26, 27, 28, 29. Okay. Medical, we're going to skip for now because that's my $5 challenge. And we're going to see how much we have left over once we finish everything. I did auto already. Um, debt is going to not get anything extra this week this month because i'm trying to save up for that something that i'm changing so no extra money towards debt all the extra money will be saved um into my extra for now okay so for vacation that is our saveopoly so we have to roll 10 times, guys. Are you guys ready for this? 10 times? This is my save Um, <laughs> I have to roll for one, two, three, four, five. So I'm just gonna add my little gold marker here. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay. And I have my blue dice and my little token. Right here we last left off at railroad number three so one two three and here we go first roll okay we have an eight one two three four five six seven eight community chest so dice times seven eight times seven is 56 if you guys hear um, that sound that would be my son playing with his cars and yeah okay so $56 for the first roll and the second roll we have eight again so one two three four five six seven eight yeah one two three four five six seven that's two dollars and that is the first brown so brown one two dollars so that's fifty eight dollars so far let me just keep tab. So 56 plus 2. That's 58. So next we're going to roll for week 24. We have 10. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That's the first red for $10. And let's roll again. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Another community chest. Six times seven is 42. And that is community chest number two. So that's $52 we have to add. So plus 52. We're up to $110. Okay. So now we have to do week 25. Can you see? Yeah. Okay. Let's move this quote for a minute. Okay, let's move you up a little bit. Ah. Okay, there we go. So for week three, we have five, one, two, three, four. Uh, we have chance. So this is the second chance. And that is dice times five. So five times five is 25. Okay. That's okay. And then we have 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 
that's green two and that is for $26 and I'm sorry if I'm going kind of fast I just don't want this video to be long so 25 plus 26 that's 51 dollars yeah so plus 51 we're up to 161 dollars okay so week 26 now seven one two three four five six seven that is dark blue number two and that is 35 dollars that's my little boardwalk right there and let's go ahead and roll again. Ooh. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's regular blue. So blue. Number one. Five dollars. So that's an extra 40. So 35 plus five is 40. Now we're up to $201. Vacation is about to be set. I am going on vacation in August. So I'm hoping to save at least a thousand dollars. Okay. So now the last week, here we go. Nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That is railroad number two. And that is for $25. And then the last roll. And I'm really sorry, it's kind of rushed. But I just don't want it to be long, like my usual videos. Is seven. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Chance, the second chance. And that's dice times five. So, four, five, six, seven times five is 35. So, 25 plus 35 is 60. Right? Yeah. Five, five, ten. Yeah, sixteen. So we're gonna add sixty. So we're gonna have to write we're gonna have to add two hundred and sixty one dollars to our vacation envelope. Yay. Alright, so we ending at chance two for thirty five dollars. That is great. All right, so for vacation, I'm just going to add it here. We're going to add $261. 261 plus 698. We should have $959. All right, here's my vacation. Okay, here's my vacation envelope. Let's go ahead and add two hundred and fifty-one dollars. I'm oh, sorry. All right, here's my vacation. So let's go ahead and add two hundred and sixty-one dollars. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Twenty, forty, sixty. One, two hundred and sixty-one. Let's just count it real quick. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 20, 40, 60. Whoops, you see, that's why I have to count again. Just trying to get out there. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 20, 40, 60, one. Okay, must add this to vacation. Yay. So we're adding for June, I'm just going to write June, $261. So it should be $9.59, so make sure. $6.98 plus $261. All right, so $9.59. Let's go ahead and count. We're almost up to 1000 I cannot believe it. Okay, and I still have a month to go, so I should definitely be making my mark of $1,000 for vacation. 
because I'm going to be gone for two weeks. So I do need at least $1,000. And then I will do an unstuffing of my vacation money if there's anything left. <laughs> but we are getting our own groceries for the two weeks that we're going to be there. So we'll see. Okay, so 9.59. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 20, 40, 60, 80, 6, 20, 40, 60, 80, 7, 20, 40, 60, 80, 8, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 9, 10, 20, 30, 40, 5, 50, 5, 56, 57, 58, 9, 59. Oh, that is amazing fund is now at $900. I can now add in three more colors here. This is sold by Chris Budgets and you can get it from her Etsy shop which is called Chris Prints It and I will leave this link below if you like this vacation 1k. <music> Okay, guys, so this is my updated vacation 1K. So each item is $100. So you have 10 different items here. So I have one more to color in, and then I make the $1,000 mark. I cannot wait. I'm so excited for that. And again, you can get this from Chris Princet. And I love this so much, Chris. So thank you for having this in your shop. All right, guys, let's keep going. Okay, now we're going to update our Summer Stolces Savings Challenge. And I said I was going to save $25 a week. And that would be $125. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, and a 5. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, and a 5. So this is my money. I'm just going to go ahead and write my 25s in. Because I did budget for, for that. Um... $25. This money came out from my wallet, which unfortunately I could not show because <laughs> I just was not doing what I was supposed to be doing. But I did save $125. Next, we have jump into June, and I just saved $20 a week because all I can really do with this and this i can only save about 20 dollars a week with it so that was one two three four five so that's a hundred dollars 20 40 60 80 100 okay so what i'm going to do is just highlight the sunglasses because these are so cute <laughs> So here's my jump into June and you can always change this to jump into July if you want to and do it for July. All right. So as you can see, I have a lot of blank spaces here that need to be filled out. So let's go ahead and figure out where we're going to put the rest of this money. All right. So first things first, the singles always go to my son, whatever's left over from my regular budgeting. So one, two, three, four, five dollars is going to go to him. And right now his panda is broken, so I have to make, I have to get him a new panda. It's totally not working at all. I changed the battery, still not working. His panda, I changed the batteries and it's still not working. And when I opened it, it one of the wires were off. So I was able to get the money out and I'm just going to leave it in here in my safe in this bucket here. In this What is this? <laughs> what is this? So I'm just gonna leave his money in here for now, just to keep it safe in the safe. Okay, so I'm just gonna add it to the rest of his money. And this is all his singles so far. He's just really in the money. He has this plus the other savings. Oh my goodness, he's just. And I do plan on counting all these singles that he has at the end of the, whoops, 
at the end of the year. Just put this over here for now, and I'll put that back in my safe. Okay, so what is important? I want to put this $40, well, $20 in home and $20 in, where is it? Get ahead. Okay, so here's my home binder. So home will now have five hundred and thirty dollars. One, two, three, four, fifty, seventy, ninety, five, ten, five, thirty. And I know I'm all over the place, and I'm so sorry about that. I really just missed the ball with my budgeting here. So that's $530 now. And then get ahead is in my other binder. And that's going to get $20 as well. <clears throat> so this is going to get $370 now. June. So 100, 200, 350, and 70. Okay, whoops. All right. <clears throat> now going back to this binder, we're going to go ahead and add um, $10 to short term travel. So that's ten dollars here, and short term travel. Oops, forgot I already opened it. So for June, ten dollars. That's two hundred and seventy. One, two, twenty, forty, sixty, seventy. And the other 10, <clears throat> excuse me. And then the other 10 is gonna go to Carter's school. I do need to bump that up because he'll be starting school uh, pretty soon. So that's 195. He's three, but you know. You never know. So one fifty seventy eighty ninety-five. That's now in school. Alright, now the rest of them starting with taxes is gonna get five dollars. So Five, five, five. This was ten. Five, 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 five. Okay. Starting with taxes. I forget that I opened it already. <laughs> taxes is gonna get five dollars, and I'm gonna update these later. So now it's at 75. There we go. Activities and dues is going to get five dollars. So 50, 70, 90, 
110, 120, 125. On the first three, you should have two hundred and seventy-five dollars. Our anniversary gets five. That's going to make it 275. Okay, so one, 250, 75. Oops. And I did school already. And that's that binder. Okay. Next is my binder. <laughs> My binder is pretty small. Let's just update this to 195. All right, so Tilly's getting five dollars and Beauty's getting five dollars. And as you see, I have a little line here because I, I didn't have enough space. So it's gonna be. I start with zero. It's gonna be five dollars. So I'm gonna have five dollars for Tilly, and then Beauty's gonna have thirty. All right, so for me, $5, you can see that. I already have it open. Look at this marker on me, oh my goodness. All right, so $5 for me. I'm just gonna go behind here and just add it for Beauty. Beauty now has $30. Business is going to get $5, and that's starting over. So business gets $5, and support gets $5. And I'm just, you know, I spent it. I spent it, and that's what that was for, you know. I did a lot of things for my business that you will see eventually really soon. I'm really excited about it. Uh, hopefully it turns out the way it's supposed to and everything goes according to plan so five dollars now is in business and then i'm going to go to support and add the five dollars there and i will i will bulk back up guys and i will support you guys once again and i love supporting you guys you know that um okay next we have Giving and giving is getting five dollars, so it's gonna be two hundred and five. Let's go back to giving. And giving actually needs to go because I know who I'm gonna give to. I just need to do it. So giving has two hundred and five. Next we have Target and Amazon starting over from scratch. Five dollars each. Let's just go there and that's okay I haven't been to Target in so long I do have Target gift cards but um, I'm missing my Target Amazon's getting five dollars and shout out to Arison's love she had a giveaway and lucky for me I won her giveaway which was the Amazon gift card and that really helped me so much because I miss using Amazon so much. Now that all these are settled, we're gonna go back up to emergency and we're gonna add $15. So $15 for emergency. Oops, okay. Let's just take it out. One, two, three, 15. Let's add it here. So we're gonna have 2,500 and $35 for emergency. So here we have my 1,000 placeholders and I will be changing them out really soon for my nice pretty ones. So that's 2,000, let's put that to the side. One, two, three, four, 500, 20, 
535, so 535. So we have $2,535 in our emergency fund. That is beautiful. <sighs> that is amazing. Okay. Then last, everything else goes to medical. And I wanted to make sure that at least $20. And I wanted to make sure that at least $20 goes into medical. So we have 20, which makes it 200 dollars even okay so here's our medical and carter does have a hearing test coming up and because that's a specialty it's gonna cost me like 75 dollars so yeah all right so that's 20 dollars here Added to my ballot challenge. And let's go ahead and count this bad boy. We should have $200 even. Ready? I'm ready. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 200. Everything in all here and accounted for. That is just beautiful. Surprise here is no longer there anymore because there's no longer a surprise happening <laughs> so that's that is canceled for now maybe i'll bring it back up later but there's no surprise happening anymore so i took out that money and i gave it to maintenance but 200 dollars of that i decided to invest so only 75 dollars went to auto maintenance Right, so let's go ahead and start. All right, so I got $1,246. Right, let's go ahead and total this up here. Right here, my son's... <laughs> show in the background i'm sorry about that um he's in the room with me so this total balance now is ten thousand two hundred and forty one dollars um just let you guys know this plus this is not going to equal this because of the um surprise that i had taken out but this is what it is this way ten thousand two hundred and forty one dollars and i'm so happy i'm over the ten thousand mark <laughs> Ooh, it only took six months but um, I made it $10,000 in six months. I'm so <gasps> happy. Okay. All right. So this is my updated sinking funds plus, you know, for the month of June. I am so, so happy. And I hope I don't use anything yet. So guys, this is my updated $10,241. Yay! <laughs> I am so happy. Oh my God. All right, guys. So have a wonderful day, morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are. Bye.